Roberts, hey, boy, what can you do? Oh, we're live, Reg. Come on, stop nattering. Hi, good morning, and welcome to Singing Bears Online with Stoke on Trent Libraries and me, Librarian Chris, and of course, we have Reg the Library Dragon as well. It's a lovely morning, it's still a bit cold. I'm waiting for spring to warm up a bit. I don't know about you, it's typical. Last year it was boiling hot when we had to stay inside, and now we can go out and it's a little bit chilly. Um, but it's a bit warmer in the library. That's why I've got my t-shirt on. Okay, so we've got action-packed session for you today. So let me know who is watching so I can say hello and welcome you to today's session. And before I forget, the word of the day, today's Word of the day is sausages. That's right, sausages. So, when you hear me say your name while I'm saying hello, then I want to hear you guys shout sausages. Okay, the word of the day is sausages because today I thought I would do 10 fat sausages at some point during today's session and I have never done it before, so that might be interesting. Okay, so that's why the word of the day is sausages. Of course, we've got our usual jungle animal warm up, okay? So we're gonna do that very shortly. Uh, we're gonna use some musical instruments today. So if you've got some bells or maracas uh, or a drum somewhere, we might be, we'll be using those today at some point. We will be also visiting Old MacDonald down on his farm. So, if you can see or think of any animals that we might see while we're up visiting Old MacDonald, let us know, let Librarian Amy know in the comments below and so she can let me know and we can sing about all of the animals that you have spotted or can think of. Okay, I wonder if it'll be regular farmyard animals or it might be a bit unusual today. I love your suggestions, they're ace. It keeps me on my toes. Okay, what else have we got? Oh, we've got a colour song coming up, bouncing up and down a big red tractor. And what else do we have that I need to tell you about? I think that's it. So we'll begin with our jungle warmer. Oh, and of course, if there are any songs or rhymes that you would especially like to hear and sing today, then please let us know in the comments and I'll do my best to fit them in. Isn't that right, Reg? Yes, we'll do our best to fit them in today, in today's session. But on with our jungle themed warm up. So remember, it goes to the tune of clap your hands, clap your hands, clap them just like me, but we're going to be, firstly, a tiger. So I would like to see some paws, just like this, and some claws, okay? And we're gonna grrr, we're gonna growl like a tiger. Are you ready? And it goes, be a tiger, be a tiger, be one just like me. Grrr, be a tiger, be a tiger, be one just like me. Grr, be a tiger, be a tiger, be one just like me. Grr, be one just like me. Grr, well done if you did some great grrring. Wonderful. Give yourselves a round of applause. Now, I wonder, I wonder if tigers like sausages. What do you think? Do you think tigers like sausages? Do you think they have a barbecue? Okay, we're going to say hello to a few people. So remember, the word of the day is sausages. So when you hear me say your name, I want to hear you shout sausages. Are you ready? So hello to Emily, welcome to today's session. Hello to Arthur and Xavier, welcome to today's session. You are most welcome. Hello to Erin and Oliver. Hello, I hope you're enjoying today's session and warm up, which brings us, we'll say a few more hellos shortly, but 
we're going to move on to our next jungle animal, which is, can you guess? <laughs> a monkey. So can you be a monkey just like me? Are you ready? And it goes. Be a monkey, be a monkey, be one just like me. Be a monkey, be a monkey, be one just like me. Be a monkey, be a monkey, be one just like me. Be one just like me. <laughs> Give yourself a round of applause. Well done. I wonder if monkeys like sausages. Do you think they would, they would exchange their bananas for sausages? I'm not so sure they would. I don't know. But on with some more hellos. Remember, the word of the day is sausages. It's all about sausages today. Wonder, are you having barbecues at home? If the weather's nice, do you have sausages? I don't know why we're going sausage mouth today, but we are. So, when you hear me say your name, I want to hear you shout sausages. Are you ready? So, hello to Lola and Bobby the Bunny. Hello, welcome to today's session. Hello, Maya, and hello, Morgan. Hello, Oscar and Mason and Elliot. Welcome to today's session, and hello, Isabella, Meadow and River. You are most welcome. Now remember, if there are any songs or rhymes that you would love for me to sing in today's session, let me know in the comments below and I will do my best to squeeze them in. But for now, we're going to, oh, we're going to move on to our next jungle animal, which is, we're going to do a bit of wriggling because we're going to be snakes. We're going to be hissing snakes. So you can put your hands together like this and put them above your head. I want to see you wriggling those bottoms. Wriggle your whole bottom. And like me, we're going to be a snake. Are you ready? And it goes. Be a snake. Be a snake. Be one just like me. Be a snake. Be a snake. Be one just like me. Be a snake. Be a snake. Be one just like me. Be one just like me. Give yourselves a round of applause. Well done if you were being some wonderful wriggly snakes. I do like wriggling. Okay, let's go and continue our hellos. Are we ready? So hello to Cody May. Hello Cody May and Mummy. Welcome to today's session. Hello, oh hello another river and Myla, welcome to today's session, and hello to Jude. You are very welcome in today's session. Thank you all for joining us. And so, our final jungle animal for our jungle animal warm-up is an animal that has a very long nose like this. Can you guess what it is? That's right, it's an elephant. Now, if, well, maybe... When I've done these warm-ups before, you have probably heard that I'm not very good at making elephant noises. And so I thought for this warm-up, my elephant, instead of trying to do the usual elephant noises, my elephant is going to use his trunk as a trumpet and he's going to go doo -doo -doo. Okay, so if you're, if you, like me, aren't very good at making elephant noises, then maybe you, your elephant, can use his or her trunk to make a trumpet sound. Do -do. Are you ready? Shall we give it a go? So nice, long, swinging trunks. Are we ready? And it goes. Be an elephant, be an elephant, be one just like me. Do -do. Be an elephant, be an elephant, be one just like me. Do -do. Be an elephant, be an elephant, be one just like me. Do -do. Be one just like me. Do -do -do. <laughs> there we go. Give yourself a round of applause for your trumpet playing elephants. There we go. Excellent. Well done. Okay, so we're going to move on. Now everybody has joined us. We're going to move on to our hello song so we can say hello to everyone. So before we can start singing, I need to see some big wavy hands just like this. Excellent. Well done. Sitting up nice and tall. Are we ready? 
and it goes. Hello to you all today, all today, all today. Hello to you all today. Hello everyone. Big round of applause. Well done. Okay, I think we might, we've had some excellent requests come in so far. So I think we'll do, we'll do some of those first actually, I think. We'll skip over my plan and we'll do some awesome suggestions. And I think we'll start with River. Well done, River. We're going to start with River's suggestion of row, row, row your boat. So we're going to begin. We're going to sit up nice and tall in our rowing boat because we don't want to rock and fall over. We're going to grab onto our oars and we're gently going to start rowing away from the bank and in and down the stream. Merrily, merrily, just like a dream. Are you ready? And it goes. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, 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 life is but a dream. Well done. We're going to keep rowing. Thank you, River, for this suggestion. It's a suggestion. We're going to keep rowing down the stream. Now, if you see a crocodile, don't forget to ah scream. Okay, are you ready? Slowly, slowly. Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. If you see a crocodile, don't forget to scream. <gasps> ah! Quick, I'm going to row very fast away from that crocodile. Oh, it's very snappy. It's a very snappy crocodile. Dear, oh dear. It must be very grumpy or very hungry. Having a late breakfast, I suspect. Okay, now. We are rowing gently down a river. Now, if you see a polar bear, don't forget to shiver. It's getting a bit colder. Should have bought a jacket with me. Are you ready? And it goes. Row, row, row your boat gently down the river. If you see a polar bear, don't forget to shiver. <laughs> Freezing cold. Oh, Ooh, I've just been told Isabella wanted to hear Row, Row, Row Your Boat as well. So thank you to both Isabella and River for this suggestion. Now, we're going to keep rowing and we're going to be rowing down a little creek. Okay, so now if you spot a little mouse, I'm sure there are plenty of mice around here. So ooh, there's one down here. If you sp spot a little mouse, don't forget to... Squeak, 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 just like a mouse. Are we ready? And it goes. Row, row, row your boat gently down the creek. If you see a little mouse, don't forget to squeak. Squeak, 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 squeak. Not sure my squeaks are very convincing. Okay, well done. Give yourselves a round of applause for that one, but we're going to keep going. And I don't know about you, but all of this rowing is making me a little tired. Shall we head back to shore now? If you see a lion there, don't forget to roar. So I want to hear some really big roars. So don't forget those paws and claws. Okay, some big roars. Are we ready? Nice and tall, grab tight onto those oars, gently back to shore. Are we ready? And it goes. Row, row, row your boat, gently back to shore. If you see a lion there, don't forget to roar. Roar! Oh, God, scared me with that roaring. That was awesome, very loud. Give yourself a round of applause. Now, it's a bit tricky this next bit because we're going to try and get out of the boat. We're going to rock, rock uh, our boat gently to and fro. Are you ready? Rock, rock, rock your boat gently to and fro. Watch out, give a shout, into the water we go. Ah! 
splash. Oh dear, well that wasn't very successful. Give yourselves a big shake, get rid of all of that water. <laughs> oh, we're back on land, okay. Give yourselves a great big round of applause. That was wonderful rowing. We didn't have too much success getting out of the rowing boats, but never mind. It was a lot of fun. A round of applause. So thank you again to Isabella and thank you to River for that suggestion. It was ace. Okay. So we've had we've got somebody else who's joined us and it's her first time. So before I say hello to this person, remember today's word of the day is sausages. So when you hear me say your name, I want to hear you shout sausages. Are you ready? So hello to Pippa. Welcome to Pippa. Thank you for joining us. It's your first time, so I hope you're having a great time. Okay, so we've done our We've done our uh, row, row, row your boat. Thanks again to Isabella and River. And now we're going to do Jude's suggestion. Jude's very energetic suggestion of head, shoulders, knees, and oh, stretch all the way down to your toes. Now, I'm going to stay seated like this, otherwise you wouldn't see my head if I stood up. But you guys at home, if you can, you can stand up if you have some nice space to do this in. We're going to start really slowly, okay? Really slowly, just so everybody knows what we're doing. And it goes head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, and eyes and ears and mouth and nose, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Well done. But I suspect that that was pretty easy for a lot of you at home, so I think we can go a little bit quicker. And I hope that the grown-ups are standing up beside you doing this as well. Everybody on their feet, except me. Okay, are we ready? A little bit quicker. Okay, and it goes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, and eyes and ears and mouth and nose, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Well done, brilliantly performed. But you know what? I think we can go even quicker than that. Yes, I believe in you, okay? Are you ready? We're gonna go super quick. And it goes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes, and eyes and ears and mouth and nose, head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. Well done. Big round of applause and a big sit down for any, <laughs> any grown-ups or anyone who's lost their breath. Okay, so thank you Jude. I'm not sure some of the grown-ups at home will be thanking you Jude, but I am thanking you. Well done for that suggestion. That was ace. Thank you very much. Okay, so let's move on to our next uh, request, which comes from Erin, uh, and it is Baba. Black sheep, here we are. We need to find our little entrepreneurial sheep. He thought he was on holiday, but no. You've been called back. Never a moment's peace for him. It's always working. Okay, so I've been still excited to uh, be singing his song as always. Oh, I haven't forgotten. Yes, we're going to sing this song twice. So once about the little boy who lived down the lane, and once about, yes, that's right, the little girl who lived down the lane. So are you ready? I know you're ready, but I'm asking them if they're ready. Yes, are you ready? And it goes. Ba, ba, black sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame, and one for the little boy who lives down the lane. 
Thank you, said the master, thank you, said the dame, and thank you, said the little boy who lived down the lane. Give yourselves a round of applause. No, we're not, don't take a bow just yet. We could, remember, we've got to sing the second one. He hears an applause and he's got to take a bow. I don't know. Okay, so remember, we're going to sing it once more, but this time about the little girl who lives down the lane. Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes, I know you're ready. And it goes. Ba, ba, black sheep, have you any wool? Yes, sir, yes, sir, three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame. And one for the little girl who lives down the lane. Thank you, said the master. Thank you, said the dame. And thank you, said the little girl who lives down the lane. Give yourselves a great big round of applause. Okay, off you go. Take your bow. There we go, Barbara. Thank you very much. We're very sorry to disturb your holiday, but you enjoyed it nevertheless. And thank you to Erin for that suggestion. We do love that one. It's one of our favourites. Okay, what else have we got? Okay, so we're going to take a trip to the farm. Okay, we're going to take a trip in very shortly to Old MacDonald's farm. Now, if you can spot any animals that you think we might see when we go to Old MacDonald's farm, let Librarian Amy know in the comments, <coughs> excuse me, and she will let me know and we will sing about those animals. But before we get uh, to Old MacDonald's farm, we're going to sing about a scarecrow, because you usually see scarecrows in a field on the way to a farm, around a farm. We're going to sing about the Dingle Dangle Scarecrow. So, can you pretend to be a scarecrow? Now, I'm going to be sitting down like this, but you guys can stand up and pretend to be a Dingle Dangle Scarecrow. Are you ready? We haven't sung this one for a while. And it goes. When all the cows were sleeping and the sun had gone to bed, up jumped the scarecrow and this is what he said. I'm a dingle dangle scarecrow with the flippy floppy hat. I can shake my arms like this. I can shake my feet like that. Well done. Give yourselves a round of applause. We're going to sing the second verse in a minute because I need my hat. I've just realised I need my hat. Here it is. Can't be a scarecrow with a flippy floppy hat if I don't have one. Okay, so we're ready for the second verse. Stand up straight like a scarecrow and pretend to be asleep. Are you ready? And it goes. When all the hens were roosting with a moon behind a cloud up jumped a scarecrow and shouted very loud i'm a dingle dangle scarecrow with the flippy floppy hat i can shake my hands like this i can shake my feet like that wow don't give yourselves a round of applause you know what i like that one i think we're going to sing that one again so especially now i've got my hat i can really play the part of the scarecrow so can you pretend to be a scarecrow again? Arms uh, out wide, her head to the side, pretending to be a sleeping scarecrow. Are you ready? And it goes. When all the cows were sleeping and the sun had gone to bed, up jumped the scarecrow and this is what he said. I'm a dingle dangle scarecrow with a flippy floppy hat. I can shake my hands like this. I can shake my feet like that. Okay, are you ready? Pretending to be asleep again. And he goes. When all the hens were roosting and the moon behind the cloud. Up jumped the scarecrow and shouted very loud. I'm a dingle dangle scarecrow with a flippy floppy hat. I can shake my hands like this. I can shake my feet like that. Give yourself a round of applause. Well done. I do like that one. We haven't sung that one for ages. So that is a favourite of mine. And we are now 
at Old MacDonald's Farm. Yes. And so we're ready to sing about a few animals and we've had some really good suggestions. If you have any other ideas of what animals we might see on the farm, let us know in the comments and we'll sing about those as well. But to begin with, we're going to go with Lola. Lola has come up with a wonderful suggestion of a frog. And I've got a little frog here. I've got one down there as well. Frogs everywhere. We're going to sing about a little frog on old McDonald's farm. Now, what do frogs say? They say, that's right, ribbit, with a ribbit, ribbit here and a ribbit, ribbit there. Here, a ribbit, there, a ribbit. Everywhere, a ribbit. Are we ready? And it goes. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm, he had a frog, E-I-E-I-O. With a ribbit, ribbit here and a ribbit, ribbit there. Here, a ribbit, there, a ribbit, everywhere, a ribbit, ribbit. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Look at that, a very excitable frog. Pop you down there. Give yourself a round of applause and thank you to Lola for that suggestion. And we've had another suggestion this time from Erin and she spotted a dragon. She spotted Reg lounging about on the farm. He's supposed to be helping, bringing in that hay, but he's having a bit of a nap, okay? So I wonder if our singing will wake him up. So what can we do for dragons? We're gonna go a rah, rah here and a rah, rah there. Are you ready? And it goes. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm, he had a dragon, E-I-E-I-O with a roar, roar here and a roar, roar there. Here a roar, there a roar, everywhere a roar, roar. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Don't think it's worked. I think he's still sleeping on the job. Is Reg. Reg, we'll leave him to it. Okay. Thank you to Erin for that suggestion. So what else can, what other animals can we find on our farm. Well, we've had one sheep and I can see another one over here. So I think we might do a bar bar. And maybe, what's this little chap here? A dog as well. So maybe we'll do a woof woof as well. But first, we'll sing about our little lamb. We'll do a little lamb on the farm. Are you ready? And it goes. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. And on that farm, he had a lamb, E-I-E-I-O. With a bar bar here and a bar bar there. Here a bar, there a bar, everywhere a bar bar. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O. Wow, done. I think we'll have one more with our dog, one more animal on our farm before we move move on to our colour song about a very colourful tractor. Okay, but first let's sing about our dog on Old MacDonald's farm. Are you ready? And it goes. Old MacDonald had a farm, E-I-E-I-O, and on that farm he had a dog, E-I-E-I-O. With a woof woof here and a woof woof there. Here a woof, there a woof, everywhere a woof woof. Old MacDonald had a farm. E-I-E-I-O. Give yourselves a big round of applause. And thank you to those wonderful suggestions. They were ace, thank you very much. Okay, I said that we were going to sing about our tractor. So I need to hear lots of colours. What colour tractor shall we sing about? Okay, we're going to begin in a big red tractor. But what other colours can you think of? Hmm, let us know in the comments below. 
Okay, so use those brains. What's your favourite colour, maybe? But to begin with, we're going to be bouncing up and down in our big red tractor. Okay, so can you sit nice and tall? Are we ready? Hold on tight to your tractor and it goes. Bouncing up and down on my big red tractor, bouncing up and down on my big red tractor, bouncing up and down on my big red tractor, bringing in the hay. Hey! Well done. Big round of applause. Awesome. I think our next colour will be the same colour as red, the same colour as our frog over here, and it happens to be my favourite colour as well, and of course it is green. So we're going to be sitting atop a big green tractor. Are you ready? And it goes. Bouncing up and down on my big green tractor, bouncing up and down on my big green tractor, bouncing up and down on my big green tractor, bringing in the hay. Hey! Well done. Okay, what other colours can we think of? What colours have we never had before? We've had turquoise before, we've had purple I think before, have we had orange before? Should we try an orange tractor? Are you ready? Hold on tight to that steering wheel. Are you ready? And it goes. Bouncing up and down on my big orange tractor, bouncing up and down on my big orange tractor, bouncing up and down on my big orange tractor, bringing in the hay. Hey! Well done! Big round of applause. Awesome. I think we'll do one more colour. What colour can I see? Oh, Reg has got a lovely blue scarf on and he's still wearing his blue wrist power bands okay so i think we'll sing about a big blue tractor are you ready nice and tall hold on tight and it goes bouncing up and down on my big blue tractor bouncing up and down on my big blue tractor bouncing up and down on my big blue tractor bringing in the hay hey big round of applause Okay, we've had a couple of colours coming in so far. Lola had wanted to see blue. Well, there we go. We've just sung about blue. Just for you, Lola. Thank you for the suggestion. And Arthur and Xavier have come in with a white tractor. I don't think I've ever seen a white tractor before. Okay, I'm guessing there might be a slight delay in our, in our streaming. Okay, so we're going to do a couple more colours. So this next one, big white tractor. Thank you to Arthur and Xavier. Are you ready? And it goes. Bouncing up and down on my big white tractor. Bouncing up and down on my big white tractor. Bouncing up and down on my big white tractor. Bringing in the hay. Hey! Big round. Well done and thank you to Arthur and Xavier for that suggestion. And who have we got now? <gasps> Isabella has come in with a wonderful suggestion of purple. What an awesome colour, purple. So thank you, Isabella. And everybody, sit nice and tall, hold on tight to that steering wheel on their big purple tractor. Are you ready? And it goes. Bouncing up and down on my big purple tractor, bouncing up and down on my big purple tractor, bouncing up and down on my big purple tractor, bringing in the hay. Hey! Well done! Wonderful suggestions. And now we have, oh, one final one from Erin, sneaking in there at the end. Pink, lovely pink, bright pink tractor. Are you ready? Hold on tight. Hold on tight, bouncing up and down on a big pink tractor. Are you ready? And it goes. Bouncing up and down on my big pink tractor. Bouncing up and down on my big pink tractor. Bouncing up and down on my big pink tractor. Bringing in the hay. Hey! Oh, well done. Thank 
you, uh, thank you, Erin. Thank you for that suggestion, and thank you to everyone for your all those different colours. That was wonderful. Give yourselves a great big round of applause. Well done. If we've missed any, I will make sure that I'll include those colours into next week's session. Okay, just in case I've missed anybody. So uh, we've had a couple more suggestions, and we we'll try and fit those in. Time is ticking on, but that's okay. We're still going to do our sausage uh, song, ten fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Um, but we might do. Arthur and Xavier have come in with a song of five little speckled frogs, and I think I've got a little craft down here that librarian Amy did, and I've lost a frog. I've lost two frogs. I don't know where they've gone, but let's see. Oh, I found it. It's having too much of a good time in the pool. Okay, so I think we might do this one. Now, uh, Oscar, Mason, and Elliot have come in with a suggestion for Animal Fair. Now, I'm not so sure about that one, so uh, I think you guys requested Mr. Golden Sun before. So if you give me a week, I will do my best to learn it and... I will uh, do that one next week as well, okay? But for now, we've got a couple more uh, suggestions. <laughs> we've got a few more suggestions. Uh, okay, we've got three more suggestions. Okay, we're going to be here till 12, I think. Right, okay. <laughs> but our first song uh, is Five Little Speckled Frogs, and it's thanks to... Arthur and Xavier. And I think I remember the words, but here we go. <laughs> Sent the librarian Amy into a panic now. Are we ready? And it go. Oh, I should say, if you don't have a craft like me, then you can use your fingers like this. But mine are going to jump into uh, the pool like that. But yours, if you're using your fingers at home, I want to see you go... Like that, jump in and create a big splash into the pool, okay? Are you ready? And it goes. Five little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious bugs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Then there were just four speckled frogs. Glob, glob. Are you ready? We've got one, two, three, four. So you should have four fingers if you're using your fingers. Are we ready? Four little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious grubs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are just three speckled frogs. Glub, glub. <clears throat> one, two, three. Three little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log, eating some most delicious grubs. Glum yum! One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are just two speckled frogs. Glob glob! Are you ready? Two little speckled frogs sat on a speckled log. Eating some most delicious grubs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there's just one speckled frog. Glub, glub. One little speckled frog sat on a speckled log. Eating some most delicious grubs. Yum, yum. One jumped into the pool where it was nice and cool. Now there are no more speckled frogs. Glub, glub. Give yourselves a round of applause. Give yourselves a round of applause, a big round of applause. And a big thank you to Arthur and Xavier. Thank you very much. Okay, so we're going to do Walk Along Josie. Okay, we're going to do Walk Along Josie, and this is from Lola and Bobby the Bunny. I think we're going to use Shadow rather than Josie in Josie Arrest. Should we use both? Maybe we use both. Okay, so 
if you have the space, and if it's safe to do so, then you can stand up and maybe walk around in a circle, if you have space and it's safe to do so. I'm going to remain seated here with my two horses, okay? And we're going to begin walking along with Josie, okay? Then we're going to trot a little bit quicker, then we're going to canter, a little bit quicker than that, and then finally we're going to gallop. We're going to go as quick as we possibly can before we whoa, slow right down. Are we ready? And it goes. Walk along, walk along, walk along, Josie. Walk along, walk along, walk along, Joe. Walk along, walk along, walk along, Josie. Walk along, walk along, walk along, Joe. Bit quicker, we're going to trot. Trot along, trot along, trot along, Josie. Trot along, trot along, trot along, Joe. Trot along, trot along, trot along, Josie. Trot along, trot along, trot along, Joe. Bit quicker, we're going to canter. Canter on, canter on, canter on, Josie. Canter on, canter on, canter on, Joe. Canter on, canter on, canter on, Josie. Canter on, canter on, canter on, Joe. We're gonna go really quick. We're gonna gallop, gallop on, gallop on, gallop on, Josie. Gallop on, gallop on, gallop on, Joe. Gallop on, gallop on, gallop on, Josie. Gallop on, gallop on, gallop on. Whoa! Gosh, we nearly got away from ourselves then. That was we were going super fast. I'm gonna pop these horses down here. Thank you ever so much. Back to the paddock with you guys down on Old McDonald's Farm and give you yourselves a big round of applause. Well done and thank you to Lola for that suggestion. That was ace, thank you very much. Okay, so we're gonna move on to our final request that I can fit in today before we do our 10 fat sausages. I have to do, I can't miss that one out after our word of the day is sausages after all. So Erin, oh Erin spotted a worm on the farm, but we missed out that one. So instead we're going to do, there's a worm at the bottom of the garden and his name is Wiggly Woo. So I want to see some nice wiggles and I want to see some worms inching their way across like this. So can I see a wiggly worm on your finger and can I see some nice Wiggly bottoms. I see some nice wiggles like this. Wonderful. Excellent. Are you ready? And it goes. There's a worm at the bottom of my garden and his name is Wiggly Woo. There's a worm at the bottom of my garden and all that he can do is wiggle all day and wiggle all night. The neighbours say, what a terrible fright. There's a worm at the bottom of my garden and his name is Wiggly. Wig, wig, wiggly. Wig, wig, wiggly. Whoa. Some fire and wiggle. Get rid of those wriggles and wiggles. There we go. Get rid of those fidgets. Give yourselves a great big round of applause. Well done and thank you to Erin for that suggestion. Well done. Okay, so there's a, we've had some fantastic suggestions today. Thank you very much. I love getting lots of requests. So remember Oscar, Mason and Elliot, look out for next week and I will do my best to learn animal fare. It's going to be an interesting one and I'll see if I can in, uh, include that into next week's session. Okay, so watch out for next week. But for now, after all of this activity, I think it's ready. We're time. We're ready for some sausages. I don't know about you. I'm a bit peckish now. So here we have our 10 fat sausages. Let's just make sure that we do have 10. So can you count with me? I should say never. I'm going to hold her by our handle like this. Always by the handle. So we got one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. So ten fat sausages sizzling in a pan. One goes, and another goes, if you can, bang, like this, really big clap. And if you can do, all the better as well. Are we ready? And it goes. 
Ten fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Ten fat sausages sizzling in a pan. And if one goes, and another goes, bang! There'll be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Eight fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Eight fat sausages sizzling in a pan. And if one goes, and another goes, bang! There'll be one, two, three, four, five, six fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Six fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Six fat sausages sizzling in a pan. And if one goes, and another goes, bang! There'll be one, two, three, four fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Four fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Four fat sausages sizzling in a pan. And if one goes, and another goes, Bang! There'll be one, two, two fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Two fat sausages sizzling in a pan. Two fat sausages sizzling in a pan. And if one goes, and another goes, bang! There'll be no more sausages sizzling in a pan. Okay, always always get a grown-up to handle the pan. Okay, there we go. Let's pop that one down here. Give yourselves a great big round of applause. Wow, how much time, time has gone on. So all we have time now for is our goodbye song. But before I say goodbye, let me just remind you that tomorrow, oh I've got something else to say as well, uh, tomorrow I will be here at 11 a.m. with Saturday Storytime. Tomorrow we're celebrating grandparents with a couple of wonderful books by Benji Davis. We've, we've shared some Benji Davis uh, books before about the storm whale. He's written a couple of awesome ones about grandparents. We've got Grandad's Island and we've got Grandma Bird tomorrow, beautifully illustrated. I'll be sharing those tomorrow as well as links to a craft where you can make some wonderful, beautiful, colourful birds as well. So that is tomorrow at 11am. And uh, don't forget, librarian Janet will return for Singing Bears on Tuesday at 10.30. And I will be here next Friday at 10.30, hopefully having learned Animal Fair for Oscar Mason and Elliot. Okay, I can do it. And before we get to our goodbye sign, I just wanted to show this because we had another beautiful picture sent in to us. And this is from Lola. And it's awesome. It's under the sea. It's given me ideas for next week's warm up. We've done some jungle warm ups, but maybe we'll do some ocean or under the sea warm up next week. And she has drawn a beautiful picture of under the sea. We've got a puffer fish. We've got a hammerhead shark, we've got a squid with lots of tentacles, and we've got a turtle, and we've got a fish as well. So thank you ever so much, Lola, for that beautiful drawing. I'll pop that up somewhere, maybe over here. Just like that. Okay. If you have any drawings that you would like to send us, you can do so. Libraries are open in a limited way, so you can always pop them into us as well. Drawings will probably go into have to go into quarantine for a bit, but uh, we're next when they're uh, available, we will show them uh, on our next uh, session. So please do send us some more drawings. They are ace. But for now. It is time to say goodbye. I know, I've had such a good time. We could go on till lunchtime. But it's time to say goodbye. We're going to say goodbye to everybody. So remember, the word of the day is sausages. So when you hear me say your name, I want to hear you shout sausages.
Are you ready? Nice big wavy hands and it goes. Goodbye Emily, goodbye Arthur, goodbye Xavier, it was nice to see you here. Goodbye Erin, goodbye Oliver, goodbye Maya, it was nice to see you here. Goodbye Lola, goodbye Bobby the Bunny, goodbye Morgan, it was nice to see you here. Goodbye Oscar, goodbye Mason, goodbye Elliot, it was nice to see you here. Goodbye Isabella, goodbye Meadow, goodbye River, it was nice to see you here. Goodbye Cody May and Mommy, goodbye Myla, goodbye River, it was nice to see you here. Goodbye Jude, goodbye Pippa, goodbye everyone, it was nice to see you here. Thank you ever so much for joining us and thank you for all of your wonderful suggestions for rhymes and things keep them coming in. But for now, it's time for our universal goodbye song. So keep those arms waving as we sing goodbye to everyone. And it goes. Goodbye to you all today, all today, all today. Goodbye to you all today, goodbye everyone. Until next time, bye.